everyone, my name is Dana. I'm here with Comic Books for the Win Parlay Cosplay. We're at the Montreal Comic Con today with Monica Lee, cosplayer extraordinaire. So hi, Monica. What's up? <laughs> so uh, is this your first time in Montreal? Uh, no, actually, my dad's from Montreal and uh, my mom is French Canadian. So I don't know what time this has been here, but I've been here uh, for a while. But it's my first Canadian convention, and uh, everyone's really awesome, so I hope to come back, at least. <laughs> okay, so I guess it would be pointless for me to ask you if you've gotten the chance to tour the city, so... Oh, yeah, no, I've, I've been around. How did you get into cosplaying? Um, let's see, it was uh, 2006, and I was really big into anime, uh, so I just, you know, looking at Naruto and Bleach and all those animes online, and I stumbled across uh, cosplay.com and a lot of like YouTube videos and stuff and I was like, wow, people dress up as, you know, like as characters and they just go around and do things, like it's a thing. And so I just, you know, I tried it out and it was all, it was all downhill from there. <laughs> do you get into character when you're in a costume or do you just wear the costume? Uh, typically when I, you know, want to evoke, I guess, the personality of a character, I do photo shoots and stuff. So I like to, you know, I pose as a character, I try to embody like the very look of it. So I look, you know, for settings and I try to do the makeup really similarly. Um, but you know, I'm Monica Nakasi, I'm not gonna go around as like Belle and be like, oh hello princess, because I'm not very good at that. <laughs> uh, what's been the most challenging part of making a costume? Um, I would say, well, there are a lot of challenges for sure. Um, you know, like managing your time and like a budget for sure, because you could be like, oh it'll be like 20 bucks, but then like you run out of fabric, you gotta buy more fabric. So I guess just more of being realistic in what you can do and like, you know, don't set like a crazy deadline of I'm going to make a costume in two days because you might need like a couple of months or so. Talking Heroes of Cosplay, um, what has that experience been like and how has it made an impact on your life? So it's been finished for a while. Uh, it's pretty cool. It's just kind of weird when I'm like, I was in the parking deck at a movie theater and someone was like, are you on Heroes of Cosplay? And I'm like, no. And then it's like right away. <laughs> It's kind of bizarre because I'm not really used to it, but uh, it's been really cool so far. Everyone's been really receptive about it, um, so it's it's cool. Cosplay. <laughs> All right. Well, thank you for taking the time to interview awesome. me. Thank I you appreciate so much. it. Thank yeah, you. Definitely.